And hi there, and welcome back to another informative video of Wondershare Dr. Phone. So Francisco is right here with you again to discuss the reasons behind iPhone charging slowly and their possible solutions. So we're going to talk about 10 ways to resolve an iPhone's charging problem. So let us move to the video's main topic. But before that, do remember to subscribe to our channel for more content just like this and hit that notification bell. Now let's dive right in. Part 1. Why is your iPhone charging so slowly? So first, we need to look at the possible reasons behind the slow charging of your iPhone. In this video, we're going to talk about most common reasons behind iPhone charging issues. Number 1. Defective charger. If you use a wired charger, then it is likely that there is some problem with your charger. You either need to replace the cable itself or, or the adapter or both. Next is going to be charging port. Now the charging port of your iPhone may have become clogged due to dust and other kinds of debris. You will need to clean this to resolve the issue. Next is faulty outlet. So it is very likely that you're probably just using a faulty outlet or one that, it, that just isn't really working properly that could be causing this issue to begin with. So you should try using other outlets to check if your regular outlet has any issues whatsoever. Software update. If you haven't updated your iPhone for a long while, it can cause performance performance issues like slow charging, updating your iPhone to the latest iOS version can resolve many issues too. Now part 2, fix iOS system errors with Dr. Phone system repair for iOS. So a major reason for your iPhone charging slowly is the underlying system issues on your iPhone. So in order to resolve those issues, you need a comprehensive solution which is available on the form of Dr. Phone system repair for iOS. It is a great tool that provides a completely safe and secure way to repair issues in your iPhone. So let's go ahead and check out the quick and easy steps needed to perfectly repair your iPhone system issues like iPhone charger. First, open Dr. Phone on your system and then click on System Repair. Afterwards, choose iOS and then iOS Repair on the next screen. And then next, choose your iPhone's issues and press Repair Now. So there then are going to be two repair modes and you should go ahead and select Standard Repair as using Advanced Repair will delete all of your data. So next, you will need to activate the recovery mode on your iPhone from there. So just connect your iPhone to your computer and then select trust option to trust your computer. Now follow the on-screen instructions to activate the recovery mode. And then once it is activated, just select the iOS version used in your iPhone to download and install it. The system repair tool of Dr. Phone will verify the firmware before installing it across your device. And then once it is done, just hit the repair now button to repair the iPhone charging slow issue. And when the process is finally completed, Click done to end the process and start charging your iPhone at normal speeds. Part three. So here we're going to have 10 easy fixes for iPhone charging slowly. So these are going to be some pretty rapid tips that should help you out quite a bit. Now, many common fixes can be used to resolve the slow iPhone charging issue. The effectiveness of these methods does depend upon the underlying issue behind the slow charging of your iPhone. So fix number one is going to be to force restart your iPhone. So force restarting your iPhone can help resolve minor software bugs or glitches to resolve the slow battery charging of your iPhone. Now the steps for force restarting differs depending on your iPhone model. In this video, we're going to go through the force restart process for all current iPhone models that matter. So for instance, for iPhone 8 and later. First, quickly press and release the volume up button and perform the same with the volume down button. Now press and hold the side button until the Apple logo appears and then finally release it. For iPhone 7 or 7 Plus, press and hold the sleep wake button with the volume down button and then just wait for the Apple logo to appear. And once the Apple logo appears on your screen, you can just release the buttons and then let the device restart from there. For iPhone 6, 6S Plus, or iPhone SE, first, first generation or older, press and hold the home and sleep wake button together until the Apple logo appears. And then once the logo appears, just release the button. Fix number two, force restart while charging. So you should use the force restart method while your device is charging to get the most out of it. So before using the force restart method while charging, ensure that the iPhone has been plugged in for a reasonable amount of time to have the sufficient battery required for this method. Fix number three is going to be to switch to airplane mode. So turning on the airplane mode while charging your iPhone can improve the battery charging speed. 
It helps stop a lot of processes and allows the device to charge properly. So let's look at how you can switch on the airplane mode on your iPhone. So first things first, just open the settings on your iPhone and navigate to airplane mode. And then you can just toggle it on to enable the airplane mode on your iPhone from there. Fix number four, change optimized battery settings. So the battery optimization settings on your device can also cause your iPhone charging issues. It doesn't allow the battery to be charged beyond 80%. So if the charger is connected for a long time, you can just turn that off by using the following steps. So to start the process, just open settings and then tap on battery on the iPhone. And then in the battery settings, just select battery health and charging. And then you can see the information about battery health and charging on the next screen. And then here, just go ahead and toggle off the optimized battery charging option if it is already turned on. Fix number five, update all of your apps. So outdated apps on your iPhone can affect the battery performance of your device. It is important to keep the apps updated so that they are always optimized. So let's go through the steps that you need to follow to update your iPhone's app. Step one is just going to be to launch the app store on your iPhone and then tap the profile icon from the top right corner. You can see all of the updatable apps by scrolling down on the next screen. And then from there, just use the update button located in the very front and then continue to have all of those apps updated from there. Fix number six, update your phone. So Apple continues to provide updates for iOS to improve the performance of its devices. If you haven't updated your iPhone for a while, it can be the reason for slow iPhone charging. So update your iPhone to the latest iOS version by using these steps coming right up. Now on your iPhone, go to settings and tap general. In the ensuing screen, press software update. If any new update is available, just go ahead and tap download and install to start downloading it on your device. So ensure that you have a good and stable internet connection when updating the iPhone. Fix number seven, remove your iPhone case. And I know this might sound a little bit silly, but overheating of the device is a major cause of slow battery in smartphones. It is true. If you use an iPhone case to protect your device from environmental damage, just remove it when charging your iPhone. It can cause the device to become overheated and interrupt charging. Fix number eight, reset all settings. So restoring your iPhone settings to default settings can also help resolve the iPhone charging slow issue. It removes any kind of an unintentional system modification. So let us review the steps to reset all settings on the iPhone for your ease. First things first, just navigate to the settings on the iPhone and then tap on general to open the general settings. Here, just go ahead and select transfer or reset iPhone and then press reset to proceed. Now choose a reset all settings from different reset options and provide your iPhone the password to complete the process. Fix number nine, factory reset your iPhone. So factory resetting your iPhone to its original state can also resolve the slow iPhone charging problem. However, your iPhone data will be deleted in the process during the factory reset. So create a backup and follow these steps to factory reset your iPhone from the settings. So after opening settings on your iPhone, press general and then select transfer or reset iPhone. And then from there, all that you have to do is just go to the next screen, tap erase all content and settings and follow the on-screen instructions to factory reset your iPhone. Fix number 10, stop using wireless chargers. So for goodness sake, wireless charging might be convenient as it frees you from managing different cables, but it is also very slow. So if you use a wireless charger like MagSafe to charge your iPhone and it is extremely slow, you should move to the wired charging option instead. Part four, pros of Dr. Phone compared to other solutions. So Dr. Phone system repair for iOS provides the best and most comprehensive solution compared to all other methods. It is fast easy to use and completely secure. So when using Dr. Phone to repair your iPhone system issues, your data will not be deleted. The tool also provides solutions for numerous other iPhone issues and can resolve even the most severe issues using its advanced repair mode. And it is finally time to end today's video. So we sincerely hope that you were able to resolve your iPhone charging issues with the help of this video. So give it a thumbs up if you liked it and share your experiences in the comments to show your appreciation. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more content just like this and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss anything. Now, until next time, have a good one.